So it used to be a lot easier, right, when we just called everything laptops, because for me, I'm quite confused, because now we've got notebooks, netbooks, and then ultrabooks, and I don't totally know what an ultrabook is. It's very new. It's very, very new. I mean, okay, what I do know is it is thin, right? Mm -hmm. It's quick to resume, mm -hmm. and it's got a long battery life. That's basically it is in that a nutshell. It? Okay. I mean, what, what Ultrabooks are is a category or an initiative, however you want to look at it, that Intel has created um, for laptops. So they are still laptops. Um, you know, they're not tablets or anything. They are uh, a category of their own. And basically, they have to conform to these, these standards, these minimum requirements, in order to be considered an Ultrabook. So yeah, the first one you mentioned is, is it being thin. So for an Ultrabook, um, anything up to 13.3 inches on the screen, it can only be at maximum 18 millimeters thick, which is not a lot. We're mm. talking thin devices here. Skinny. And that's a maximum. Um, you know, many of them are going to be smaller. Then for a, um, a 14 inch screen and above, it can be uh, 21 millimeters, as such as the a new S series that Asus has just come out with. Um, so, you know, with, but we're still talking, you know, damn thin devices. Um, then you're talking battery life. The uh, minimum battery life is five hours which is, you know, that's a good time. Good. Yeah, and that is nice. a minimum. You actually look around, a lot of them are more like eight and oh, above. Really? Um, yeah, these are just minimum specs after all. Um, and finally, as you say, is quick to resume. Um, you know, you've got different modes on your laptop. So if you hibernate, for instance, it takes a little bit longer, you're talking at maximum seven seconds. But if you're doing just a straightforward standby, which is usually what happens if you close the lid in your laptop, mm -hmm it's pretty much instant. You're talking two seconds and under um, wow. in order to, to resume. So, you know, really quite cool. And, and, and seven and quite seconds nice is the maximum, right, anyway. For a hibernation. So, yeah, I mean, so seven seconds is nothing. Yeah. I mean, that's the time it takes you to flip it open and, you know, jostle in a chair and it's, it's ready yeah, to yeah. go. So, and, we're, and, you know, we're, and we're talking ready to use, completely ready to use, not still waiting for things to load. Mm. So those are basically the three things that, um, I mean, there are other bits, but those are the main three things. So does that mean that all Ultrabooks are pretty much the same? No, 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 not at all. I mean, this is, these are minimum specifications. Okay. So, um, you know, they say five hour battery life. As I say, you're going to find out a lot more than that. Some are going to be a lot thinner. Um, and this is also, there's, there's been one generation of Ultrabooks so far. We've now got the second generation of Ultrabooks coming out, such as the Zenbook Prime. And they have specified that they have to have USB 3. Mm. Um, as standard and you know these uh, this is going to evolve over time um, in order to keep kind of like making sure that the products improve. So this is a handy way really I guess of picking I guess you just think okay I want this category of it's, ba it's basically work. it's a category for people that want um, super fast super thin super economic laptops yeah um, and you know if you know you want those things you look at the Ultrabook category, you're not going to have your time wasted by suddenly seeing loads of desktop replacements. So that's what it's all about. Cool. Well, thank you very much, Spode. I hope you guys are just as well informed as I feel. Um, if you would like to leave any comments, then please do so on the website and you can also comment on our lovely forum. And of course, don't forget to subscribe on YouTube and iTunes so you can see our latest episodes. Until next time. So I hope that you guys are as well as informed as I have feel that I may be. <laughs> do, 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 do.